So when I made a video yesterday of me destroying the threads on this crank, made a lot of people mad. So um, this crank's junk, so they can calm down, but let's use it as a learning experience and show you how to fix some really messed up threads. I don't know if I can fix it or not, but we're gonna try. I'm gonna take a handy dandy thread file. This is one by New Thread. It's a really nice tool. Um, it has all different thread pitches on it. You can get them uh, where it just has one if you have a dedicated file, but I don't do this that often, so a multi-file is nice. I'm gonna use a little Marvels as like a cutting, cleaning oil. Uh, keep a wire brush handy to clear out the threads. And what you have to first do is find what thread pitch you have, either look it up online um, or actually um, verify it by sliding it into a good part of the thread and make sure it fits the pitch correctly. And you start in a clean area and work your way into the bat area, keeping it nice and straight. So um, you don't want to try and file like this. You got to go with the thread. It's a slight angle because of the way the threads are cut, but just kind of get it down in there, put a little cutting oil on it, and just start cleaning that out. So I'm gonna put this on a time lapse and see if we can save this just so that we can throw it out again. So here are the final results. Um, took me about 15 minutes with the thread file, the or the threads cleaned out as much as I could. And then I just put some oil on there and ran it on and off by hand um, with just a ratchet back and forth um, until, I mean, you can see now it, uh, that's both directions. So it's not perfect and it might not hold as much torque as it originally would have, but sometimes that will save a part from the trash can. Um, so good old thread file. Does the trick.